crap. Okay, we're good. Ah, we're good. Okay, unless the thing falls over or wants to. Oh, it's just an empty box. Oh, no, it's got non-stick pads in it. Soft and absorbent. Stops the bleeding. It'll be good for my later crash. And look at that view right there. That's right, a pretty nice day. Until the afternoon. And he thought it was going to rain and be cold. It's said no rain in Canyon City. Canon City. Enduro is pretty fun. Speed limit 30. Let's go 90. It's KLR. The almighty KLR. Ah, some nice twisties. Okay, that's too much gravel to take care of that fast. Now it feels like that might have been the road. This must be it, huh? Got some deep gorge things in the road. I think this is at least the park that he was talking about. You just go and find some place to ride right there. Uh, which one looks more traveled? Let's go left. Is it a loop? Well, here's how you solve that. Actually, there's kind of more money there. And then it's a loop. Okay, so the other trail, maybe. What if the target shooting area has a way across? I'm gonna get shot here. Gosh. Um, if I wear my helmet, I'll be safe. Uh, just keep your helmet on and it'll deflect bullets. Kind of a weird little maze. Pinion pine maze. It's going generally in the direction we need to go, but it might just come up to a dead end or something or the top of a mountain. So total for this trip, we've gone 22 miles. Lots of washouts. <laughs> El Canyonses. I guess this is a decent trail, even though it's not like a trail. Stop and have a drink. Not bad, not bad. It's kind of neat. It just needs to get over to the other side of this ridge right here that we're on. And <laughs> it's so muddy. Look at my mud box. <laughs> well, that was a mistake. <laughs> There's gonna be a lake at the top. And it ends. Oh, well, I guess, you know, it's another lookout. The road we need to get to is there. We would have to go around this mountain over there all the way then. Huh? Well, now we know where we're going, at least. El Canyonses. El Canyonses. Yeah, they're gonna shoot us. Whoa! Hup, hup, hup. <laughs> so there, there's the whole adventure squad. Still one guy behind him. Last guy, I guess, just gave me a peace sign. Oh, well, that's just a house. And that's a bridge. Wait, no, that's another house? No, it's a... What the heck is it? Oh, it's even past this cattle guard, Red Canyon Road. Wow. So we totally overshot where we we're needing to go. This says Red Canyon Road. We're on here, I just saw a sign. We must have missed a turn. I don't know. If there were a turn at all, I don't know. We're gonna find this highway. It must be over here somewhere, right? Well, it's gotta be before this ridge. We explore this canyon city a little, I guess. Ugh. Okay, that was about the fastest stop I've ever done. No outlet. So turn left. What if there's an outlet here? Well, this is like a neighborhood now. This is what we came here for. You take the next right if you see anything. Actually, wait a second, wait, I'm gonna stare at this. Enduro it through there! You can go over that, yeah, for sure. <laughs> and look, they have golf carts! Why would you just have golf carts? Being a ham radio operator is a weird hobby. Like, I get to talk to random people on the other side of the world. <laughs> Their goal is to try to see how far they can reach. You just talk to random people, just about stuff. 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. So you got eight minutes till we can speed. Ooh, that's hard. Ah, shoots it down. Looks like that must be the main road up there by... Oh, maybe I'm just getting us lost. It's an enduro town. Oh, I hit a bug. Ah, I can't leave a bug in my eye. This is Main Street. We found our way back. At least Main Street will probably be interesting. Hotel St. Cloud. Everything looks closed. There's nobody here. But normally with these outdoor malls, you see people walking around, right? Body art studio. Does that mean a tattoo parlor? Maybe that guy knew what he was doing. Building with razor wire. Don't really want to drive towards that. Like the road in? It's a prison, right? Oh, it's a prison museum, too. Kind of neat. We are intrigued by a prison. <laughs> <laughs> is any part of this still used as a prison? 1802. It's a tourist attraction. This is not a public park. Keep out. This park is for prisoners only. If you want to be one, come on in. Breathtaking tourist attraction, it says. Welcome to Cannon City. So inside the motorbike, there's a bunch of things that just move around and make stuff happen. And magically power comes out. What are you saying? So that's the road back there. 29, all right. Like, there are somehow these roads connect, but they don't. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, and that is a good 20 miles. Why am I rolling? I'm pressing on the back brake, and I am leaking something. Is it rear brake fluid? My rear brake is busted. One of the bolts broke off. I did bolt it on right. It was working before. Because it's completely empty. The reservoir. So it broke. Oh, the thing isn't connected. 
Oh, it, it jammed. Well, I guess you won't have any back brakes. It's a good thing we're not going down any mountains. Here we are back in the town. Canon City. Turn a gas station into a bike rental place. A motorcycle and small car pickup camper. That's crazy. And it's just a tent. A tent in a box. <laughs> Doesn't count as a camper. If I didn't hit him, I was like a foot away. Right? Ah, crap. I'm a terrible person. Look both ways before I die. Turn right, maybe? This is ARO and life without a back brake. Can't stop as comfortably. White bicycle. There's a thing where I guess they chain up bikes to places where somebody died. Hey, that's what said Canyon, not Canon! Tilda, why would you own three? Oh, they're all brand new. They're all identical smart cars. Are you excited for some rain run? We're going straight for it. Said it wasn't gonna rain, so I don't know. Maybe it's uh, farther away than it looks. It's definitely cooling down like it's gonna rain. The air got colder. No shock. I just saw some lining up ahead. Four Mile Creek. Well, do you want to drive up this uh, little oil thing and just maybe the top of the ridge and look at it? Uh, yeah, sure. Is it off on the left or the right? I guess on the right. Huh. I don't know if it really goes anywhere, is the thing. Closed in wet conditions. You think this is a big park? Oh, I guess there's the map. Well, now we know, huh? It's not that big, though. I'm gonna get rained on. There's no motorcycle or ATV. I mean, there's just like some roads. Is it a bolt broke it off, or? No, the bolt came out. So the bolt actually must have not been torqued properly. It's not raining yet. It's coming for us. Lost signal. Guess I'm all alone now. He's gone. I can't hear him anymore. That's gonna beep at me. Now I can hear you. Oh wait, I, I'm on the top of the hill though. You're all the way out on the road. That's funny, I'll catch up here in a bit. Regain signal? Whoa, I don't wanna be over there. Oh, and it's raining! Ah! My hands are gonna get wet and cold. Oh, we're almost there anyways. Oh, and I lost signal again. You dead? Oh, good, there you are. So do you know about the rain, right? It's always the first 30 minutes that are dangerous. You know, the oil and the rubber that's worn off from the tires. I wonder how all those other biker guys are doing then. Okay, now I'm cold. I'm like, oh, it's gonna be fine. They didn't say any rain, just like maybe drizzle. But you know, it's like fine for this jacket. It kind of resists water a little bit, but not enough that it's waterproof. So I can feel it going into my shirt right now. Just mainly on my shoulders. The rest of my body isn't really getting hit. Oh, this rain is sort of painful, I would say. I am freezing. I guess I admit I'm shivering, but I'm also kind of warm, honestly. Well, I'm kind of comfortable now. Maybe the storm will go past us. So supposedly we could have gotten here from that dirt road, but it's pretty funny because we would have gotten lost. Looks like we'd have to go over a mountain ridge too still, huh? Get lost for sure. <laughs> we'll come back another week.